How's it going, everybody? It is December 8th. I'm going to do a Merch by Amazon or Merch on Demand uh, sales review. Talk about the first seven days of the month. Talk about kind of uh, what I expected and, and what's going on and then some of the other things that, I, uh, that I'm working on. First thing, I, I want to point this out. Uh, they've increased this twice, I would say, in the last month, which is the upload uh, limit. I, I think it went for at least my tier. I can't remember if it was 3,600 to 4,000, and now it's 4,400. This is, I'm pointing this out because this is unusual, and I've talked about this before. It's unusual at this time of the year if we're comparing, you know, to what merch was, let's say, three three years ago, let's say three or four years ago, because a couple years ago, they would be throttling and they would be actually limiting and restricting our upload limits sometimes completely uh, blocking us from uploading new products around this time so I, I wish I had more information maybe I'll, I'll do some uh, some bit of research and, and everything to, just to see because I know once in a while we'll we'll actually get updates and reports about uh, the money that that Amazon in, is investing in this uh, business and w when it comes to new machines and all that new like printing presses uh, and uh, and staffing and, and new facilities. So I, I wonder how huge this part of the business is now, where, where they're able to actually encourage us to to upload more, uh, because it is the, the exact opposite from you know a few years ago. Let's talk about the numbers. I'm sitting at 53 sales this month in the U.S. Uh, that comes out to one thousand dollars and twenty one thousand and twenty dollars in sales for the first seven days, which is amazing, right? Royalties uh, 173.84 and royalties per sale are a little higher than I, I would say the last couple of months right now sitting at uh, 321. And that's that's mostly because of, uh, uh, you know, what's selling, which is uh, basically, you know, uh, T-shirts and then a bunch of other products that are that are not really like for example pop sockets are not dominating they're not you know 50 percent it th right now it's sitting at at 24 right that might change uh as we kind of go on but uh but that's that's how it is right now i'm sitting at 91 uh total sales which is good this is actually amazing for for seven days uh so so december so far even though these are not extreme numbers and i'll do another video just talking about you know numbers in general uh if if we're comparing this to the last couple of months, I mean it's it's great. If uh, if I look at uh, you know the first seven days of of November, and November was uh, I would say kind of like an average month. You know I was sitting at sixty eight. So we're talking about 30, 30 sales difference for for these numbers. That's a, that's a thirty percent um, increase, which is great, right? So I know that we're deep into Q4. I, I understand that these numbers are not exploding, uh, but again, I'm not running any ads. Uh, I have done absolutely nothing uh, to, to kind of boost these numbers. So this is all organic, and, and I'm just kind of doing my daily thing. So the numbers, I, I would say the increase is, of course, expected. It's, it's not natural to increase, but it's nothing crazy. And, and that's okay with me because I, I've talked to... Uh, you know, a number of people, I've done a video basically where I've talk, talked about uh, what's happening with my other platforms. And and overall, this is the best, uh, not only year, but time of the year for me for my print on demand uh, sales. I'm, I'm just uh, going through the final uh, approvals and not approvals, but like setting up uh, my sales channel. Uh, uh, for Walmart, which will be exciting. I know a lot of people are talking about Walmart recently, but nobody's actually like kind of like going through it or, and talking about the sales. So once once I got everything set up, once I have a few products up, I'll, I'll talk about that as well. And and then just uh, uh, expanding my uh, my Amazon fulfillment by merchant. Yeah, going to Mexico is a is a uh, uh, market that I'm not in, and then some of the European markets. My, my key markets are always U.S. and Canada. Uh, even even Walmart setting it up, uh, it's much easier and faster to do the uh, Canadian uh, store 
than the U.S. But again, I'm I'm just going through that, and and then like my plan for for 2023 is just expansion, uh, and and of course merch is going to be, uh, you know, part of that with with the number of products that I'm uh, uploading, and uh, and everything that I'm kind of uh, working on. But let me just uh, do this here. But there is there is so much opportunity uh, everywhere else, and. Uh, you know, I've talked to a number of people who kind of put everything, all their time and effort and research and, and you know, into merch. And then when they kind of realize that, hey, I, I'm not able to quit my job, you know, from making money on merch, they, they get really disappointed and crushed. And, uh, you know, that's definitely not the situation that I ever want to be in. Because like I've been around for for you know a few years where and I pulled this chart up to to show you guys, you know this is not our platform. Amazon controls all this and and then you know this kind of stuff can happen at any point. And I understand that this is like a it was a you know uh, world uh, pandemic and everything. So but but again they just completely shut all sales down. And and I never want to find myself in that situation, right? And 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 again. You know, going from something like this to to a pandemic year and, and having, you know, 100 sales, 80 sales, 95 sales, and then going back up and then down. Yeah, I, I think I've learned a lot uh, about, you know, what I'm comfortable with when it comes to my sources of income for my life. And, and it, you know, one platform, no matter how powerful it is, is not the answer. But again, like merch is it, right? I, I talk about merch often. I'm just now learning that, you know, there are so many other uh, very, very tempting opportunities because there's money out there, right? So anyways, just to kind of in summary conclusion, uh, December is is going great. I'm very happy with my U.S. and overall sales. Uh, we'll see, you know, if there's like a big, huge drop off in about a week or so. Uh, but But so far, so good. Let me know how you guys are doing and uh, we'll go from there. Thanks.